Hey everyone, and we're back. So we are at the Hotel Bliblos, which is in the city center of Saint Tropez. So we're gonna go ahead and do a walkthrough how we normally do of all the spaces. Um, this particular space, it's great for um, private events and reception, in my personal opinion, but so many things can be done because you guys are gonna see it's, it's it's amazing. So um, first we're gonna start with outside and we're gonna be walking in and doing the whole tour. So here we go. Okay, so when you arrive, still in the beautiful Mediterranean style. And then walking down. So this hotel, actually, the original um, owner was a Lebanese, and he had a palace uh, in Lebanon, and he wanted to build something in Saint Tropez because he fell in love with Saint Tropez. And so you're gonna see some small details that you might recognize if you're familiar with Lebanon, but it's now owned by a French family. So the Hotel Bilos is located in the, the city center of Saint Tropez. You, as soon as you walk out, you're directly there. As you will see, it is a very, very unique space. So this is the entryway here. You can kind of see down. You can see down into a cocktail area possible there. You can see a little bit of the pool already. So. Going down to back outside, we have this indoor passage. And this particular staircase actually is uh, one part of the original construction. And the artist actually was um, inspired um, by Picasso. So you can actually kind of see, it's interesting, you can see the inspiration from Picasso. It's built into the hotel. So as we head back outside, I'm first going to go back up into that area that I showed you that's for, that you can use for a cocktail reception, and then we'll kind of go back down by the pool, always of course respecting people's privacy. So we have this area here that can be used for cocktail, as you can see, the reception area is that glassed area up there. but. You have this beautiful surrounding rooms. So there are 90 rooms. It can accommodate up to starting at around 180 guests. So you can privatize it for any type of event. They also have a spa. So for those of you who just want to do a spa weekend or a spa anniversary party, it is possible. So this space is really nice because it's kind of gives some depth to it because you have this beautiful olive tree in the middle that's kind of the centerpiece so there are three restaurants on site um, one that is located on the left there which um, is open to the public for dinner and then you have the pool restaurant as well It's gonna be a little bit tricky. There's a lot of people in the pool. So we have the pool area here. So we have the bridal suite, which is right there above the pool, which is actually designed by Missoni. So those first three windows you see there, that would be the bridal suite or the host suite, whoever would like to stay. Then we're gonna go back over, and then we have the restaurant that is here on the side, which is beautiful. And then we have another area that's back here that is the additional part of Hotel Biblos. 
you can kind of see it's all in the same spirit and it's on different levels so when you're kind of walking through it it's about it's about like five different levels y'all it's like five different levels all the way around then I'm gonna flip the camera around for a second because I want to respect people's privacy because it's a hotel known for exclusivity so we do not want to interrupt anyone's private moment so also too if you're familiar with Saint Tropez there are a few top uh, clubs that are kind of the place to be I guess you can say one of them is uh, Le Cave and it's actually inside Dulos so we can't go inside because it's shut down because France is currently under you cannot uh, clubs are not allowed to be open but the entrance would be here so I did get to see it it's very nice and the nice thing is that you can have direct street access down here so when you enter in you can either enter in from the street down here or you can enter up from the top from where I was so if we continue to walk down we're gonna end up going into the third restaurant which can also be used for um, welcome dinner as well which is very nice it's called the, the Cucina de Hotel Bilos and um, in this area you could do a welcome or a farewell you could do if you just wanted to do a private event in this area you can as well you'll see it's a very nice space as we're walking down so it's really great because your guests if they're not staying at Biblos or if you're just using this the event spaces as well they can kind of be dropped off right at the front there and then they can enter into the restaurant uh, without going into the hotel if you wanted to so it's not ready for dinner yet but we can go ahead and, and see uh, Monsieur Laurent Il m'a dit que je peux juste euh, faire une petite vidéo sur oui, le terrasse, oui. oui. <laughs> Merci. <laughs> Merci. So this is the terrace here. And this terrace, I don't know if you guys can see all the lights and the decorations and the trees, is amazing at night. And it's literally right um, on one of the streets in... right onto one of the main streets in Central Pay. So again, your guests can just literally walk in right off the streets. And the space is beautiful, being surrounded by all of the rooms. So if you guys see that bridge at the top there, that's where we were earlier when we were looking down. So we're actually looking down onto this space here, which is the Cucina and Hotel Blilos. So this area can also be used for reception as well. If you happen to have a wedding party where you're going to be spreading out against a few different venues, which is possible. You can and you can use the space which is really nice depending on your style because in central pay you have a you have a little bit of everything so you can have modern you can have uh, mediterranean you can have lebanese influence um so it's one of the beautiful things about central pay is that there's a little bit of everything for everyone So we can't show you any rooms because it's fully booked. We can't spend much time at the pool because there's people there. So that actually brings us to the end. So that is at the top of where we just came down. We were at the pool. And then, and then we have, <laughs> and then if we were to exit, um, just kind of show you the um, entrance from the streets, it would be, um, so you guys can take a look at this way it would be from this way so it's a beautiful entrance as well all right guys well that's the hotel Blibloos. i hope you enjoyed it the end of our day of visits here in saint tropez and we'll see you soon